A 54-year-old man is in hospital and in a critical condition after an incident at the new Royal Adelaide Hospital construction site. The man was working on a scissor lift when he was crushed between the machine and the concrete above. An investigation has begun to work out what happened. Grim-faced workers began leaving the site this morning after being told of the tragedy. A terrible thing happened today. Um, we, don't know the, we don't know the circumstances but it was a horrible thing. The man was found unconscious with serious head, neck and back injuries in a scissor lift that he'd been using on the second floor of the new hospital at about 7.15 this morning. The 54-year-old had started work at 6 and, as was usual practice, was operating the lift alone and unsupervised. No one witnessed the actual incident, they just found him at the scene. We've got the police on site at the moment and also Safework SA and they're investigating uh, the, the cause of the incident and obviously we're cooperating fully with that. The worker was rushed to hospital. Our thoughts at this stage go out to the family uh, and to the worker. Obviously we're very concerned with him. We're hoping that, uh, that he recovers from this. The union says it's not yet clear when the site will reopen. However, workers will meet back here at 7 tomorrow to discuss the incident and ensure that counselling is available to those who need it. The site has been the subject of several safety incidents since construction began. We expect the builders to run a safe work site. Uh, we expect them to comply with all the occupational health and safety laws and we expect them not to cut corners. The scissor lift has been removed from the site and will be the subject of mechanical testing. Rosemary Tierney, ABC News, Adelaide.